The idea of building a mosque in the shadows of Ground Zero is moving forward. A community group says it supports the project to create space for the neighborhood's growing Muslim population. The Islamic Center would stand near the World Trade Center site in a building damaged on 9-11. However, some of the families of 9-11 victims say they are offended by the whole idea. Lauren Green joins us live from Ground Zero. Lauren? Uh, well, John, one of the victim's family members told me uh, it's like building a shrine to the very philosophy that motivated the 9-11 attackers. So understandably, they're very, very upset. Now, the site of the proposed $100 million project is a building just two blocks from where the World Trade Center's Twin Towers stood. It's ground zero. So close that on 9-11, part of one of the plane's landing gears crashed through the roof. Now, the Muslim organization, the Cordova Initiative, plans for a 13-story mosque and Islamic cultural center that organizers say will be for all faiths. And the imam insists it's the right place and the right time for this project. The current need of America, the current need of the world, is for us to combat and to make a stand against terrorism. This project is about condemning terrorism. But another Muslim organization says this hallowed area of Ground Zero is about preserving the memories of the victims of 9-11, not about promoting a Muslim cause. I think this is just part of a deception that wants to exploit American freedoms and claim Islamophobia. And, and this is why I'm so outspoken on this, is because this is not about Islamophobia. This is about my family, other families that came to this country for religious freedom and don't want to use our faith as a mechanism of political action, which is political Islam, and I think this is one of the manifestations of that. Well, opposition to this project has been steadily growing as more and more groups find out about these plans. In fact, a protest is scheduled for early June. John? Lauren Green in Lower Manhattan. Thank you.